Hello everybody and welcome back to 5 Minute Crypto, the channel where we cover the most important crypto news in just 5 minutes back again with another crypto update. And this is a really interesting rumor that came out yesterday. Saudi Aramco, the world's third largest company, reportedly plans to start mining Bitcoin. So, the third largest company in the world is reportedly planning to jump into the cryptocurrency bandwagon, citing information provided by Brazilian Bitcoin miner Ray Nasser during an interview on the Bitcoinero's YouTube channel. Investing.com reported that the Middle East oil giant is interested in mining Bitcoin. Quote, we are negotiating with Aramco. All black liquid oil that comes out of the desert belongs to this company. All the flared gas they're not using and all that's public information, I can tell you it's enough to power up half of the Bitcoin network today from this company alone, Nasser reportedly said. So the report added that the company could use the excess gas from oil producing for mining digital assets. So instead of deposing of the byproduct of oil mining, Aramco can use it for money earning operations. Quote, Aramco needs to burn this flared gas. She needs to get rid of this gas that is a byproduct of their oil mining. They do. What if you find a way to make money while doing this? And Aramco has not yet issued any statement about venturing into this Bitcoin mining. Well, they actually did though. And there's a couple of different sources which stated this, but I thought, you know what? Let me get a source from Saudi Arabia. I think that would kind of help. So. Aramco denies reports that it will embark on Bitcoin mining. It was a really fun day until everything was shut down when they basically explained they're not really planning any of this. Now, Saudi Aramco has denied reports about its plans for Bitcoin mining. Quote, with reference to recent reports claiming that the company will embark on Bitcoin mining activities, Aramco confirms that these claims are completely false and inaccurate, said an Aramco statement issued on Monday. A global integrated energy and chemical company, Aramco, produces approximately one in every eight barrels of world's oil supply and develops new energy technique technologies. Yet, they really haven't thought about it. And, and let me put it like this. It's not been completely denied that they'll ever do this, but it's been denied that they were planning something like that. Yet, it also depends a little bit on perspective because the rumor basically went around saying that they could use this in a really easy fashion and that they're in talks about it because, well, it's a cool plan, right? For a company that's wasting so much energy for them to just do something with that to make even more money and potentially become the biggest company in the world. I mean, it could definitely be so. Now, I would say that Saudi didn't really want to, or I'm, I should say maybe, didn't really want to associate themselves with Bitcoin necessarily. Um, maybe they didn't want to just put this out there just quite yet and they denied it for that purpose. Maybe they are not planning anything whatsoever with their byproduct. Maybe they didn't want to talk about the byproduct. There's so many different reasons as to why they denied this. But the most prominent reason is just it's, it's been a fabricated lie. Uh, or, as I just explained before, it's a story that somebody thought of that could be cool, yet there's no real actual finality there. Like he said in the story, he thought of an idea, he talked to Aramco about it, they didn't really reply most likely, they didn't really say anything, and now people are taking it out of context saying it's that. And that's one of the fun things about the crypto space, people really often take things completely out of context. And that's a really big issue, because with crypto, they're actually so small, where a very small out of context article can actually incite a huge amount of buying or selling from a lot of small players as, once more, that's more so what the crypto market is constituting of. I mean, if you compare it to normal stocks, in the normal stock market, I believe there's way more healthy and... I guess, well-organized institutions in there. With crypto, it's a lot more memers, a lot more small fries, a lot more people are just trying to make a little bit of a buck. And the ones who read news articles like this anyway, most likely don't have billions of dollars in the bank to uh, spend. But they're the smaller guys who then get into these mistakes. And it's just, it's, it's interesting. Yet, to be honest with you, it doesn't really matter too much. It was a rumor. Price most likely didn't do too much about it, except for maybe go up a little bit. Right now, quash down. But no, it's not too bad. It's not too bad.